Oh my god, there's loads of dung beetles in here. 85? 55? There's dung beetle central in here. Oh my god, there's another one. Alright, what's up boys and girls? It's I, Domzilla, and welcome back to Ark Survival Ascended on the Ark and Art server. If you watched the previous episode, then you know what our main focus is going to be today. We need to finally start getting some crops on the go so we can make advancements to kibble. But the compost bin is too noisy and it absolutely stinks. So we're going to venture to our first cave on the island in search for a dung beetle. I haven't really done much since the previous episode. I've leveled these up like very, very minimal amounts, but I have leveled them up nonetheless. Uh, we didn't actually get any name suggestions for the twin sisters, so I'm going to name them myself. <laughs> there we go. There are the names. Big up, Jen. <laughs> So in order to tame a dung beetle, what we are going to need is either poop or spoiled meat. And I'm pretty sure that spoiled meat isn't going to be as practical. I feel like it's going to take a lot longer to do it if we do spoiled meat. So I think we're going to get some poop. We do have the Theomia from the kindness of Complex Killer. So let's get some poop going. Oh, yeah, I'll probably should show you the inventory and show you what's going on. I have grabbed this pistol, which we got in like the second, third episode, something like that. We're going to have a loot drop. I've got so many bullets that I've got from loot drops. So I thought we'll take that. That'll help us deal with the Arthros because I feel like the Sabre might struggle against them. I'm not sure. And I've also got a full set of ghillie, which we've got from the Winter Wonderland and just normal drops in general. But I've got that. That'll help the dung beetle from seeing us, okay? It's, it's going to work well. But we need to get some poop, so let's get some poop. I don't know how much we're going to need. Oh, they're the wrong berries. But we'll, yeah, we'll get quite a bit. Like, I feel like that may be enough right here. Wait, is it all fell through the floor? It's all falling through the floor. Oh my god, that's a lot of feces. I definitely don't need that much, but that is a lot. That's a lot, that is. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, now, the cave that I want to go to is around here somewhere. It's the lower south cave. It's not too far from Darby's base, actually. But we're going to go there, okay? I know that Dung Beetle spawn in there, so... We're going to head there, we're going to take Ace, and we're going to take Jen, because she is the highest level. Let's go and, let's go and grab Jen. We're just going to throw her here. Let's get on Ace. Uh, I feel like we're missing something, but I'm not quite sure. We've got a gun, we've got a crossbow. Should we make some grappling hooks, just in case? Hmm, I don't feel like we'll need any, but let's, let's make some just in case. We'll do it for the video, eh? Wow, 40 engrams? Oh my word. Right, okay, I'll get some of those made up. All right, can I make some more? I don't even need that many. Nine? Tell you what, we'll just have however... All right, five, yeah, five's good. Five's good, we do have another crossbow in here. Let's grab that, let's get that on the bar, and we'll just switch all of these around here. Look, get the grappling hook on here. Boom, there we go. We've got some grappling hooks too, that's fantastic. Don't think we're going to need them at all. But, you know, I, you never know. You never know. Alright, I'm going to keep this armor on for now as well. I'm sure we'll change over when we get there. But I'm pretty sure we're ready. I think we're ready. I don't think we need any like special potions or anything. It's a pretty easy cave. The only thing that's going to be hard is Arthroflora. So I'm pretty sure that they spawn in there. And that's the only thing that's really scaring me at the moment. But I'm going to fly there and I'll bring you back. When we are about to head into the cave because it's uh, going to be a very uneventful trip to there. <laughs> ah, okay. Now, I have also ran into this other problem. It is currently quarter past seven at night. And if there's a Megalosaurus in here, we are going to get... Oh, I completely forgot about that. I did not anticipate the thought of that. Oh, my God. This could end terribly. If a Megalosaurus is in here, we aren't going to win because those things are crazy at night time. Eesh. I don't know whether to risk it. I might go and see if Darby's in and see if he'll put the kettle on and then we'll come back after because I really don't want to fight a Megalosaurus. Jen will last a matter of minutes in there. We are at the cave, though. The cave is just down here somewhere. Is that it? I think that's it here. Where this moss chops is running. Yeah, it's in there, all right. I can see some flashy things. Yeah, I think I want to wait till daytime. Yeah, this is... Yeah. Yeah, let's go and see if Darby's in. Darby, put the kettle on. I need a cup of tea, lad. 
Darby! Darby! Put the kettle on, lad! Where are you? <laughs> Another thing that I did actually forget to point out is... I don't know where Squidward's gone. I know. It's not great, is it? Like, I genuinely haven't got a clue where he is. I feel like it might have been from the last episode when we kept dying and there was cryopodding and uh, I think he's... I think he's gone. I'm gonna have to have a good look round again when I get home, but I feel like we've lost Squidward, so... Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. Right, okay. It's currently gone back to 6 a.m. Hopefully, the Megalosaurus will be asleep now. There's probably none in here, but I like to be precautious, okay? I know how deadly those things are. All right, they would have uh, they would have done some bad stuff to our guys. I feel like we need to get rid of everything that's bad around here too. Um, all right, you can sit up here a minute, Jen. We're gonna deal with this. Sorry, Mr. Ferry, you're gonna be a problem. Die! Get out of here! Oh my God! Bro, how much health has this guy got? Back up. Right, I feel like Ace will be safe up here. We're going to put him on neutral anyway. What are you on, Ace? You're on passive. That's not good. Right, let's get you on the old neutral. I just really hope that he doesn't fly away, because that would be bad for us. Jen, are you ready for this? Should we put the ghillie on now? Let's put the ghillie on now. Here we go. It's the first time I was wearing ghillie armor in the series. Look at this. This is cool. It's a lot different than what it used to be. Look at it. That looks very weird. Alright, I've never been in a cave, so I don't know whether this is going to load in terribly or load in alright. But let's have a look. Probably should have brought a bed. Because we're pretty far away from home. It echoes in here too. Oh, it echoes quite a lot. I'm not looking forward to this. I'm pretty scared. I don't know about you lot. Look at the cave, man. This is a lot different than what it used to be. A lot different. Look at all this. There was never any of this. But this is scary. Tiny definitely wouldn't have fit in here. At least we know that. Right. Anything coming up that we can get its attention? Hello? There never used to be anything up until down here, but... Like, I don't feel like it was this long. I feel like... Whoa, okay. 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 Okay, okay, okay. That was... I didn't like that. That was very laggy. I'm definitely going to leave that in the video so you can see. Whoa! I don't like this lag. That's a little bit worrying. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, I've seen on some people's videos that when they go into some of the caves, it tends to lag them out and glitch them under the map, and they lose all of the stuff. And I really hope that that doesn't happen to us here. We just want a dung beetle. We just want a dung beetle. Bro, this entrance looks way different than it used to. I think they've just added a lot more, to be totally honest. Hello? There's normally a Megalania sat on the roof somewhere, so we need to be careful of that. Okay, I did actually forget something as well. I forgot to make some med brews. Med brews would have been a great shout. Just in case you get mega rabies from the megalania. Right. Can we see any arthros yet? I can't see nothing. I can't see anything. Hello? Is anybody here? I'm pretty scared right now. I'm not going to lie to you. But I can't see any Megalania. There used to be loads on the roof around here. But we're looking okay so far. Hello? <laughs> Is there anything in this cave? <laughs> okay. We finally got some stuff. Here we go. We're already in a fight. Let's do this. Go on, Jen. You got this. They got a decent saddle. Get wrecked, spiders. That was super easy. Jen's probably a little bit more powerful than what I thought she was going to be. Well in, Jen. Well in. All right. Can we see any dung beetles? I feel like... I've just heard one. 
Did I hear one? I feel like I heard one. Where is it? <laughs> or maybe it echoed from like somewhere else. I don't know. Right, okay. We've got some bad stuff up here. Can we see any Arthros? I need to get the Arthros with the gun. Oh, god damn it. Alright, come on then. Let's have it. I've not seen any come out of the walls yet. That is something that, you know, is boding quite well with me at the moment. Oh my god! Back up! That's a lot of spiders. But like I was saying, there's none coming out of the wall, which is a very good thing, because that was the worst thing about caves. I feel like I can hear some in the walls. We can't go under the map in cave mode anymore, so I can't see. Okay, there's definitely some in the wall. Get him, Jen. Yes, big hit that. Wow, she's actually a lot more powerful than what I thought she was going to be. Can we, uh... Yeah, there's definitely some in the wall, isn't there? Brilliant. As long as no Arthros come out of the wall, we should be good. Aha. Okay, I've spotted our first Arthro. We need to pick this off. There we go. There we go. Make sure it doesn't shoot us. Where is it? Where is it, boys? Where'd the author go? Did it fall down there? May very well have done. Well, at least it's not our problem anymore. Right, dung beetles. I don't really want to go chasing in, because if the author knocks all of our armor off, it's not going to be good for us. Okay, it's not going to be fun. Scared that he's going to come behind us. Oh, I'm a little bit worried that I still haven't seen a dung beetle as well. Back off. Okay, you're a high level, dude. At least we're not losing any health at the moment. All this is going well. I don't think we're going to go for the artifact today either. I just want to get us a dung beetle. That's all I want to get. But you guys died. Jeez, man. Get off! <laughs> Why are you so powerful? Arthro! Arthro's coming! Did you see him? Okay, we did it. Okay, okay. Wow, I almost like started panicking a little bit there. I'm sure that was the one that we started shooting first as well, because we killed him pretty quick. Okay, it doesn't do anything on the scorpion. Well, that was good. That was good. We dealt with that Arthur really well, to be fair. It'd be better if we had a better pistol, but this is all I've got. Right, okay. Can we see? Oh my god, that's a lot of stuff. Oh my god, look how many spiders there is. That is insane. Well, let's deal with all these first, then we'll get the Arthros after. Back up! Why is there so many? Oh my god! That is class from Jen, though. Okay. Are those spiders coming? I don't want to attract the Arthros just yet. But it looks like all the spiders are stuck on stuff. Alright, let's see if we can pick these off. Oh no, here we go. We got these guys coming again, man. At least we're going to get a hell of a lot of carting from this as well, boys. This is going well. This is going well. The only thing that isn't going well is that there's no dung beetles at the moment. Okay, he might be a little bit high level. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here comes a few. Oh, the spit. Oh, God. We're out of ammo. Oh, no. Spit. God damn it. All right. Okay. Come on. Load the pistol. Load the pistol, man. What is this? So of just load the pistol. Right, okay. And there goes the armor. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is not good. Oh my god, that is not good. Oh my god, that is not good. Oh my god, that is so bad. Oh my god. We're actually not gonna be able to fight all four of these. This is so bad. 
Oh, we've got ourselves trapped. Could have done with the C4 or grenade. This is crazy. Oh my god, this is not good, boys. There's one. Can they not get up here? Okay, they got up here. Wait, did I kill that? Okay, that one's dead. Oh my god, that was serious panic stations. Wait, is this thing dead? I can't harvest it. Are you dead? You look kind of dead. He's dead, but I can't harvest it. Okay. Maybe I need to equip my other armor now. It's kind of annoying that we lost all the ghillie already, but it is what it is. Right, where are those other ones? There's two more. Where are you guys? Wait. Wait, where'd they go? Okay, that's a little bit worrying. I don't know where they've gone. That may come back to haunt us. I can hear a dung beetle. I feel like he's stuck in the wall with whatever the hell's shooting at me. God damn it. Where did them other two Arthros go, though? I panicked so bad there. As soon as I seen four, I was like, yep. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, shit! Oh, no! I found him! Oh, my God! Why you guys run? No. Oh my god, this is so bad. We've run out of armor. No! Stop! You're a 130, you suck! Oh my god. Come on, get this thing reloaded, man. Die, dude. Oh my god. These things give me the biggest jump scares. There we go. Oh, my Lord, bro. We've got another one as well down here. I hope it's just not respawning them back in, because that would absolutely suck. Right, we've lost all of our armor now, so we're just going to have to full send it. Wait, where'd it go? I have no idea. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes. He's done a lap. He's done a lap. Okay, I d okay we killed it. We killed it. We killed it. Oh, my God. Our throws are honestly the worst thing in this game. They, they scare the absolute shit out of me. Any more our throws? Any more our throws? I'll take the absolute lot of you that isn't an our throw. I feel like I can see one coming, though. No, no, it's just snakes. I'll take all the snakes. I'm actually scared of snakes in real life, but our throws, they are the worst. Oh, I can see a dung beetle. Lads, I can see a dung beetle. If my eyes don't deceive me, we may be onto a winner here. Get out of here. Right, okay. I've just heard it. I'm pretty sure it's this guy. A level 25 is like blue. Oh, oh, there's one right here. Look at him. He's just chilling. It's a level 55. Right, we're going to have a little wonder. We're going to see if there's anything bad. Oh my god, there's loads of dung beetles in here. 85? 55? There's dung beetles central in here. Oh my god, there's another one. What level are you? 50? There's so many dung beetles. Oh my god. As long as there's no more Arthros. I can't be bothered with that. The 130 Uranio. I feel like if we dismount... We're going to have some problems and stuff's going to start coming after us. Let's have a look. I was wrong. Right. I think we're going to go through this one here, boys, because this one is the highest level and we only actually need one. Did you pick any armor up off anything? Of course you didn't. God damn it. At least got four levels. Jen, you can have all the melee damage because I feel like we're going to need it. can't believe I've broke all my ghillie already. That might... Stop. That might be a problem for us. Right. Can we feed you, Mr. Dung Beetle? Okay. You're going to take two feeds. We're only going to tame one, I think. Because I'd have to take it out and come back. And by the time I've done that, everything will have spawned back in. I am taming the highest level, though, aren't I? You're dead. Lovely you. 
55. Yeah, okay. So I, I definitely think we're taming the highest level. But we've got the first feed in. This is going well. This is going well. Y are you nearly ready, dude? I don't know if he's nearly ready. But we aren't going to go and get the artifact today. Okay, I just want to get this guy. And we want to get some fertilizer going so we can plant some crops. How hectic was that, though? I, I don't think I've ever panicked that much before in my life. <laughs> Arthur is the scariest thing in the world. Stop. You are so noisy. How cool are the new caves, though? Look at this. This is cool. Th this makes it a lot more scary, by the way. Having all of this cool stuff in here like this, this is very, very cool. This is the first cave I've been in on the new Ark Survival Ascended, and it looks, it looks class. It's actually a little bit intimidating compared to it just being rocks beforehand. It, this is this is cool, this is scary. I mean, look at all the dung beetles. Like, it took me forever to find all of these guys. <laughs> like, I didn't even realize until I actually opened my eyes and looked. Right, are you ready now, dude? You're still not ready. Don't worry. Don't worry. We can wait. We're patient, okay? As long as you're going to be part of the crew, that's all I'm bothered about. Isn't that right, Jen? Yeah, see? Right, come on, dude. You gotta be ready now. Yes! Yes! We got the dung beetle! Level 127. Let's pick him up. Let's get out of this cave. This cave is scary. Okay? This cave is scary. Let's get out of here. We're gonna harvest the rest of this while we're here. Let's just grab some of that. Grab that as well. Oh my god. Alright. Let's get out of this cave. I really hope that nothing has spawned up here. Because I can't get my gun out now to shoot the Arthros if there is... Well, to be fair, we still don't know where the mother two are. If we run into them... I'm just going to run. We're just going to run. We're just going to run. We're not coming back in here. Oh my god, it's the dead one. I forgot about that. <laughs> oh my god. That actually scared the living daylight out of me. I was like, no! I can't believe it spawned one on me, but it's the dead one. Right, get me out of this cave. And we'll come back in here more prepared with more friends, okay? We're going to come in here with actual friends with their teams as well. Because I ain't fighting Arthros by myself again. That was scary. <laughs> but we did it! We've got a dung beetle. Let's just get him home. Hopefully we don't get kicked across the side of the map with all of this lag. Because I'm really scared that that is going to happen. Oh my lord. Right, come on. We're almost out of the cave. I don't remember it being this far of a run down, though. This is crazy. Right, come on. Get me out. Oh, that's a parasaur. God damn it. I'm so jumpy because of the Arthros. And there wasn't even any Megalosaurus in there, so we could have done it in the night time. There we go. Now we're on ace. Let's grab Jen. Let's get back to base with the Dung Beetle. Yes! Okay, that went sort of well. Um, I don't really know if I can class that as us doing well. <laughs> it was just a lot of screaming at Arthur Flores. But we did do what we got, you know. We, we did do what we got. <laughs> we, uh, we did exactly what we were supposed to do. We've got a little dog beetle. Let's go and take him home. And we're going to show him to I am a dog. Yes. They're both going to be best friends forever just outside the greenhouse. Come on. Right, okay, we're back. Let's throw Jen down on the ground here. I'm just going to put Ace over here in his usual spot next to the Pelagornis, which I still haven't named. Oops, I forgot about that. I will do that. I'll do it next episode. Don't worry, we have a name. <laughs> right. You stop. But we have it. Look at the dung beetle. It's amazing. Let's put him in his cage. I've purposely put the cage here. We can put the dung beetle inside here. There we go. Why is it? Wait. Oh, my God. Where's he just got all that from? What? How did he get all that poop? Okay. Okay, he's just... What is going on here? How has he got all that poop? That's crazy. Has he just picked that up? What is going on here? I don't get what's going on here. Somebody talk to me. What is going on? Right. Mr. Dungbeal, what are you doing? Where did you get all this poop from? He's just picking up poop by himself. What are you doing, bro? I'm confused. Is this a new thing? Do I not have to fill it up anymore? I'm so confused. Uh, right. 
Ah, okay, yes, okay, right, okay. Well, I probably should have had a look at this before I started waffling along, but... He actually picks up feces by himself now? Um... Okay, that's cool. So, do we just put him on Wondering now? I feel like I'm still going to keep him in his cage, but if he just picks up feces constantly... Then he's just going to constantly make fertilizer forever. That's pretty cool if he does that. But I feel like that might be the thing now. Like, if you have to disable it, that, that, that's such a cool feature. I did not know that that was a thing. But now, all I can actually do is wait until he makes the fertilizer. I don't think it'll take too long. But he needs to make the fertilizer. And then with that, we can start planting some seeds. I need to have a look and see what seeds we've actually got. Let's, uh, let's just disable this thing that keeps popping up. I need to do it here. Can I disable it? There we go. Lovely stuff. Right. I, I was saving seeds, but I don't know if I've still got any. Oh, no, I haven't got any. I must not have been saving them at all. I'm a liar. Oh, my God. <laughs> right. I, I probably should go and get some on the mammoth. And then in the meantime, while the dung beetle's making fertilizer... We'll uh, we'll uh, we'll come back with uh, with seeds and hopefully fertilizer, and then we'll start some stuff planting. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Dung beetle, I need to give you a name. What should we name you? Uh, we're gonna name you Bung Beetle. There we go. That's a great name. You keep making fertilizer. If that is the new thing and they just do that, that is absolutely wonderful. The water, the electrics, and now the dung beetle. This is uh, revolutionary for Ark. I definitely think so. This is great. But, oh my god. Are you still on follow? Oops. There we go. I <laughs> thought there was somebody coming to the base that confused me so much. But, big up Jen. She did a good job inside that cave. She didn't really lose any health. It was more just me screaming at Arthros. <laughs> but, we did it. Nice. I'll, uh, I'll bring you back when we've got some fertilizer. And when we've got some... Uh, some crops and stuff that we can plant. I'll bring you back when all that is uh, is a flowing. Okay, we are back some time later. Now we need to have a look and see if something's happened. I've repaired all the armor except for the ghillie because I don't have any polymer at the moment. But <laughs> I've repaired the armor after the Arthur did its antics with us. Now, whoa. Uh, okay, that is a lot of fertilizer. Oh my god, he picks up so much poop. Look at its weight. That is insane. The dung beetles, OP. I love that it does it automatically. Right, let's grab all of this. We need all the fertilizer. Give it here. Right, is he still gonna? Is he still gonna do it? I think he'll still do it. Right, let's let's leave you in there, bung beetle. I've also brought Mrs. Regular up as well because, as you can see, look at all the seeds. Look at all the seeds. If you hold E and you can seed the fruit in the inventory, we don't actually need to do it because we've got tons. But look at all these seeds. Look at all these seeds, it's quite ridiculous, actually. I probably should show you anyway, but the Iguanodon has a very cool feature where if you seed the fruit, it does a little thing with his hands, and then we go in here, and look at all the seeds! It's ridiculous, I do not need this many seeds at all. Um, <laughs> but we're going to take some, okay? Uh, we're going to do the... Yeah, we're going to do these first. Let's go and put all this fertilizer in here. And then we'll sort it out accordingly after. Oh my god, it's full. Uh, we'll get that back out of there in a minute. Right, and this is regular. We need citronol, it's the first one. Long grass. Then we need rock arrow and savaru. Lovely stuff. Right, okay, and we're going to do the bottom ones first. Can we get the large? There we go. We're going to have savaru in here. And we'll put... So if uh, we'll put three fertilizer in each. Uh, let me grab some more. I shouldn't have put it all the way, but I have done that. <laughs> right, what did we plant again? Savaru. Okay. Right, that's the medium crop plot. Wait, did I do it in the large? I did. Okay. Okay. Right, large. So we've got savaru. We need some citronol in here. That'd be good. I did put three, didn't I? <laughs> Keep forgetting. Right, that is citronol. Now we need to go in here. That's large still. Uh, get the rock arrow in. Three of those bad boys. And then we need the last one. Where is it? Long grass. One, two, three. 
smashing. So we've got the long grass, we've got the rock arrow, the citronel, and the savaru. Look at that. That's amazing. Oh, look at it. It's all coming through at the bottom. Now, what are we going to use for the large crop plot? That is the question. Uh, let's have a look and see what seeds we've got. What we got, Mrs. Regular? What we're going to need the most out of all of these? Hmm. I think, and I know it might sound a little bit silly, but I think I'm actually going to go for a Tinto Berry in the large one. Because we're going to use Med Brews a lot when we go into the caves, okay? Med Brews are going to be good. And I need it for red dye, because I've got a big plan that we're going to do with red dye. So let's go ahead and throw all that in there. Lovely stuff. Now the medium ones. Hmm. Do I do all of those as narco berries? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. No, no, we're not going to do that, actually. Right, so we need... We need to do the rest now. For the medium ones, we want Amar, Azul, um, then we want the Mijos, and the Stimberries. There we go. The coloured ones, the new ones, I'm not too bothered about doing those, to be totally honest. Right, we got Amar. That's that in there. Then we need Azul. One, two, three. And we need to grab some more out of here. Let's just try and grab the rest of this. So we just did Azul. Look at all this, though. This is really handy, having this stacking like that. Mijo's in here. Just like that. Uh, which one do we need now? We've done Tinto. We want Stimberries in here for the Fiomia. We probably should have done more than one. Ooh, wait. Uh, do we have another one in here? We've done that. We've done that. We've done that. We could have another Stimberry one in here. I feel like that's a good idea. Yeah, let's do that. We'll put Stimberries in here as well. There we go. Right, now we need... This is regular. Uh, we want Narco Berries now. We're going to do Narco Berries all the way across the top. Okay, because we're going to be using this uh, Narcotics for a while before we get the Biotoxin. Right, small. We want this. And Oh, I didn't mean to put four in. <laughs> we're trying to distribute it evenly for now. Put that in there. One, two, three. And um, in here, more narco berries. There we go. This is fantastic. This is. <laughs> I love having it all stacked up. This is going to look insane when they're all growing. <laughs> I like it. This is super cool. All right, chuck that in there. There we go. How many more we got left? We've got three fertilizer. I should put one in there, one in there, and one in there. But lovely stuff. That is all of the crops planted. Now we just got to wait for them to grow. It might take a while. We're probably not going to get them all grown this episode. But in the next episode, we will take a good look and see what has happened. We'll see if we've got some vegetables. And then we can use the vegetables and start making some good stuff like kibble. Look, we need all the vegetables and we need all of the other good stuff as well. I feel like um, we've done good. We probably should have done more than one Mijo. Uh, maybe. I don't know. They're pretty easy to get, so I'm not I'm not too fussed about it. But that's it. I'm kind of happy. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh, that's good. Mrs. Regular came in clutch, and I can't believe how good the dung beetles are now. It's pretty insane. Look, it's just... There's so much fertilizer. It just doesn't stop. It doesn't stop at all. Look at all this. Shut that up, and we'll go and fill the box up. This is crazy. In fact, we're just going to fill the rest of them. But that's it. We've done everything that we set out to do today, and we've done it kind of well. It was the Arthros that gave us a little bit of grief, but nonetheless, we did very, very good. We have got what we needed to do today. We got our first dung beetle, and we'll have some crops ready in the next episode. Anyway, boys and girls, that is going to be it for this episode. If you did enjoy it, make sure you drop this video a like, subscribe, and ding the notification bell to keep up with further Ark Survival Ascended shenanigans. <laughs> now that we have our little bung or dung beetle friend, we can start getting all these crops done, and we'll finally be able to get some kibble advancements going in hopefully the coming episodes, and we can go out and tame some of the bigger stuff that we want. But luckily, we have the dung beetle. Ah, oh, I don't. I don't actually think that we're going to need more. I feel like one dung beetle is going to be more than enough at the rate that this guy <laughs> is, uh, is pushing out the fertilizer. But that is all. That is all from me, our new bung beetle friend, and hopefully some fruition of crops for the next episode. We'll see you next time. <laughs>